What's up everybody? Somewhat of a local celebrity here. Today we're going to get into another episode of A Daily Dose of Mortal Kombat. So let's get into it and remember to grip those sticks! What is up guys? Somewhat of a local celebrity here welcoming you back to my channel. Good to have you. Today I'm going to brag a little bit before we get into this crypt video. Top 0.8%. That good. That's damn good. Alright, that's enough of that. That's good, though. Alright, let's get back into the crypt. I earned about just under 300,000 uh, <clears throat> last night playing. Uh, this crypt has had me going. I'm uh, I'm into it. I'm feeling it. Uh, we're going to get right back into it. When we left off, we had just gotten Ermac's power to... Uh, Pull in saw, damn it. I was hoping that was the one damn thing that I was hoping wouldn't happen when I came back to the crib. It put me right back where I was before. Sorry, my controller, the controller I'm currently using is a little messed up in the joystick. Alright, so we are back in Goro's lair. I wanted to be outside of Goro's lair. As to be able to hit some of those souls and stuff that are out. Ah, oh, jeez, that's this is not what we want to be. That is, but we're about I don't know, 50 stories too low. So all this uh, bright and sunny weather's got my nose running constantly. Real bad, real bad. All right. Back into the lair we go. There is the door. There is the door. Oh, this one here. This will be the one we pop. What is it? Alright, alright, alright. Noob Cybot. We got a brutality for Noob. A new outfit, some gear. That's cool. Uh, noob is one of my favorite characters, so I'm happy to see that. Let's see what else we get here. We got a skeleton key. Uh, the camera does not work so well in these little hallways. <laughs> uh, let's see here. To get out of here, we're going to need to run down here. There's so many chests I wasn't able to pop in today, though. Brutang Brutality. <coughs> California girl. What the hell? I think there's a certain Miss Perry that might be named that Katana Brutality. Katana was my bitch in the last one, but I ran with her. That back forward A, hold A Brutality. Off with their head, I say. Off with their head. Uh, Alright. I'm just going to blow right past on everything that I come across right now. I still don't know how on earth I'm supposed to open those. <clears throat> I'm assuming at some point I'll get something to open them. Hopefully. <laughs> and uh oh man I I am deep in the crypt here good lord well here's one of the I don't think I have a just travel back to the the front like the crypt thing here let me see Oh, that's interesting. I have a lockpick that will unlock a chest without me having to spend my coin on it. Oh, uh, well, I'm assuming if I have something that'll, like, take me. thing like that. Put those there. So shit. Looks like we are uh, kind of stuck running it then. Because I don't have any secret way of getting back. So, oh look. Is that a picture of the collector there? Does that mean that he will spawn in this area? Because I have those collector coins. I used one. I hate using stuff and it not working. 
<laughs> so I'm very hesitant to to get back to uh, clicking on that. <clears throat> Goro's area, I didn't think any of this would be as big as it is. They really went all out for this trip. Uh, I was thinking about it though, and things like that probably sacrificed those other things. Like, the amount of time and the size that went into the crypt here, and the amount of outfits that we have to unlock and stuff. That probably went into why, say, we only have like two fatalities and a couple brutalities, and the mercy is a pathetic friendship. I bet that the size of some of this stuff really played into how that came to be. I mean, I'm not saying this don't look good. This looked good. This is a great little area here. Uh, I like what they've done. It's fun. It's, it's going to add some extra game time. Yesterday, yesterday uh, I recorded part 3 and 4. It was just, I got to have to do, I didn't want to post a two hour long video, I felt that was extra, so I just split it up into two. Uh, but, I could not believe the stuff I was finding and like, how deep it goes in here and all that. That was, uh, that was shocking, baffling to me in fact. Uh, alright, I see another soul down here, let's see what goes down this way. coin really just diminishes the moment that you start opening stuff. It, it does not stay around long. That's, that's something I'm gonna unlock. Oh, wasn't there some other stuff I wasn't able to open? I thought there was. There's got to be somewhere, right? This looks like a collector ass room. Look, there's all kinds of stuff over here. Back. Oh shit! Damn, he popped up like instantly. Okay, I, I bet this is. These go for a price. Oh, okay. Will you? Okay, so. Okay, I see. The collector demands a pit spike for life crystal. Adidas arm works. Outworld. I need to go. Well, the only thing that I can get is this right here. Why's it gotta be from my lifeless body? Why can't it just be like uh, from the trade I'm offering? You waste my time. You waste my oh shit, he was gone. Okay, uh, well, I had sort of suspected something like that prior to this, so this is clearly the collector's room. Uh, it does make sense what with all the artifacts and memorabilia and shit that's stored in here. That this would be uh, the collector's room. Alright, well that's cool. That's uh, that's another piece of information learned. Yeah, and it's right next to his head, so that makes sense. Uh, <coughs> let's see where this takes us. I'm tr I'm still trying to. I want to get back up to the 
top area. I know it probably seems a bit silly, but I left a lot of uh, souls up there. I got all these. I got 4,090 souls. I gotta get rid of some. There we go. There we go. This is back at the very opening of the crib, too. Is that bird always there? Does it even care of my presence? No, it doesn't give a shit about me. Okay, that's that's cool, bird. C carry on. Oh, yeah, I hear you guys. I would help you, but, you know, I don't think I can. So, we're just going to press onward. Screw those dudes. That's their problem. But good people don't get hung like that. Right? Let's remember that. I've come to that conclusion on those guys. You know, it's like, uh, at the beginning when Raiden cuts Chinook's head off. You know, good shit. Good, good people don't have shit like that happen to them. It's just the way of the world. You know, you're an immortal, you get your head cut off, so you just suffer for the next 10,000 millennia to so years on how to put your head back on? That's your problem, man. That was your fault. I mean, maybe you shouldn't have tried to enslave all of humanity. That, uh, that was a decision you made, and now you're gonna have to live with it. Now, I'm like 100% sure that when I walk up to the thing behind me, I'm gonna fix the bridge, and I'm gonna be compelled to run a million other places, so I'm just gonna avoid doing that one right now. I don't have any evidence, I haven't looked anything up or anything, I just, gamer's intuition, when when I hit A on that, it's it's gonna fix the bridge, I'm sure it is, and then I'm gonna go over there, and uh, that'll probably, we'll save that, maybe for the next video, I don't know, I wanna, I really wanna get all of Goro's lair completed, I wanted to come back here and get this stuff, because, This way. Yeah, this is where I left the party. Boom. I, I would like to know what in God's name happened to Ermac, though. He just got, like, straight up stage fatality. It was devastating. He fell right off the bridge, and we got his amulet thing here so we can, like, control souls or something now. I don't know. I don't know exactly what the hell it is that we're doing. We're harvesting souls, maybe? We're spending our souls to get whatever's in here. I don't know. It is what it is. Uh, I think this opens from the other side, to be honest. That's the conclusion that I have come to on this bridge. A jade taunt. The taunts I, I find interesting, though I haven't figured out how to do them. Because uh, I am a cocky prick in battle, so I love to, not only as I'm running my mouth, have my character, like, just pose up on you. Really make you feel like you're inadequate. That would bring me great joy. Yeah, Actually, a disco ball like Rome would be pretty tight. Have like a rainbow disco ball shining in the world of riders. That would be absolutely awesome. Got a new... I, I don't understand why they call the Sub Zero things belts when they're really just shuriken. I mean, they could even have just named it Ninja Stars, and I would have been more content with that. How the hell do I get over there? There's a bunch of stuff over there. Hold on, little fellas, I'm coming. The amount of effort that they put into the crypt this time is incredible. So, to get down there, we have to be like. Yeah, that's direct. That's just directly under us. I bet I need to open that door. I like how they've kind of set this up to where it's like a, it's like an actual game, like you progress through it. I mean, I know it is a video game and all that, but I mean, it's like a, in Mario, you know, you can't get here until you got this, and you can't get there until you get this, and, you know, stuff like that. And this right here, so this is why I think I hit that one thing, I'm definitely going to put together the bridge. I'm about to throw this or something, I don't even know. Oh, it just burst up so it can disappear and you don't see it, that's genius. Good cover up, Nether Realm. Well, that's an interesting taunt.
nothing even over here. What the, what the hell? Am I, I'm just cleaning up for Shang Tsung now out of the kindness of my damn heart? Understand that damn forge. I've put so many things in there. It has given me nothing. It sure as hell has no problem taking my coin, souls, and damn hearts, though. Ain't giving me nothing back. I still do not like it. I still gotta, I'm gonna go do Scorpion's character thing first. I'm pretty sure that's how you unlock this thing. Maiden statue kind of looks like a pendulum of those two. Sure. Okay. That will do there. I'm gonna flip it here. Call this video good. Be right back on for whoever is watching me there. I'll be going to the towers of time next. And I wanted to get up to the entrance of Goro's Lair and take care of all that stuff that I didn't get before. Do you like these videos? Do you enjoy seeing all of my Mortal Kombat content? Then go ahead and hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel. Head on over to mixer.com forward slash a local celebrity. Follow me over there for live videos. If you want to go that extra mile and help donate to the cause, head on over to Patreon, somewhat of a local celebrity over there. And as always, folks, thank you very much for watching my videos, and grip those sticks.